What's going on everybody here and welcome back to some more dredge so in the last episode we got our new hull we are at a tier three right now and uh yeah we got some more upgrades to get we got some money to be made we got things to do so yeah that's what we're gonna be doing today hopefully you guys enjoy if you do, do like subscribe all the fun things um let's see we did finish reading our book our book gave us the relaxed mind 10 percent resilience to panic so that's when we get this eye up here that's us panicking freaking out so that's super cool but I think what we need to do today is um, it's a combination of things. Uh, we need to go ahead and get some scrap. So we're going to go around and try to find some scrap. I need uh, wood specifically. So like this, I, need, I definitely need, I need wood. <laughs> we need logs and stuff like that. Uh, so we get some upgrades going. And then we need to uh, we need to knock out some. Oh, I will happily take those. Uh, we need to knock out some some of the quests that we have because the rewards for quests are usually those upgrade components uh and we need to get a bunch of those going because like i just want to get like all of the things you know i'm just having such a good time with this it's just it's so much fun so uh yeah upgrades today that's gonna be the that's gonna be the plan so hopefully you guys enjoy if you do like subscribe all the fun things also i did pick up a dlc which i don't even know what it gave me to be honest it gave it gave us something um it said something about like a new a building or something like that that had some like things in it and then that we could then utilize or something i'm not 100 sure so um i'm gonna head back over here though i'm not gonna do any fishing i'm gonna let the net do the fishing for me today we're going to see because there's a spot back here that usually has yes 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 resources oh plenty hopefully oh look at that a bolt of cloth you know i gotta say I think the bolts of cloth are probably one of the most rare items. It seems like I'm usually out searching for bolts of cloth before I'm searching for any other resource. Um, I could be wrong, but it seems like that's usually the case. Usually uh, scrap metal, I have a ton of like, <laughs> now we're about to get some more scrap metal, but that's okay. I'd rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. You know what I'm saying? Plus you never know, we might need a ton of scrap for our, um, our next upgrade you know who, who knows Ooh, there's a thing over there so that light over there is just like a, it's like a paranoia thing um there's not actually anything in that light but it, it makes you freak out and like you know act all weird and stuff so um as far as i know now there is <laughs> at that other island there is a giant fish monster so like i mean there is a fish monster there Okay, let's sell what fish we have, and then let's go into the dry dock. Okay, so um, I guess I want the engine upgrade first. So we'll get that, upgrade that bad boy, and then let's see, we need two wood, two wood. I don't think I have any more wood here, so that one's done. Um, two bolts of cloth. Wow, are we actually, we're actually gonna need wood more than anything, I think. Okay, and then what about this guy? Wood and cloth. Okay, so we need more wood, more cloth. Let's go ahead and send these to our inventory here. That looks good. And then let's do some research. Now, I think we need to get this guy done with, just to get it done with, so you can buy him and get him. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish it. We'll have one more, um, that'll be done. And then we can start working on these. Also, I really wanna work on this, because this gives us coastal, shallow, and oceanic, all the fishing all in one which would be super nice. Okay, let's see, where else might we find some resources? I think, oh, our uh, our thing just broke, okay. So there are some over here sometimes. Here we go, here we go. Ooh, it's cloth too, okay. So I know we need, what, two cloth for our next upgrade, but we're gonna need more for our hull. Because as soon as we finish this upgrade, we can start putting stuff towards the um, the next hole upgrade too. Oh, super exciting. All right, so that one's done. Let's see, sometimes there's some... Let's go take a peek over here. Ooh, don't hit the rocks. Okay, so we got those. We got some of these guys. Oh, is that... Is that considered... You're gonna be considered ocean, aren't you? Yeah, darn it. I need, we need to get our oceanic rod back out. Um, I actually think we're gonna need it for some of our, um, some of our missions that we have. Not see anything. Yeah, there's a thing over there, but we don't have any explosives yet. So can't do anything with that. Let's peek around here. There's those rocks right there. They don't do anything. We've touched them. 
Uh, we already cleared that out. Ooh, hold on. We got some glowy bits right here. Let's just take this out real quick. Might get something good here. Oh, yeah, look at that guy. Neat. Okay, so we got that. Um, also, you know what? Actually, I need to mention this because I did this in my own time. Um, this thing right here, uh, I can't even interact with it, but, but essentially if you fill it with the type of fish, like that one wants that like right angle fish, if you fill it with that fish, it gives you an item. Um, and that's actually what's in my... Oh, I can't see it right now. Um, I had it in my cargo. It was some, it was some weird uh, rod, some like fishing rod thing. But uh, yeah, so, oh man. Do I even really want? Yeah, because there's a chance they could give us the um, a research module. Okay, so we got a little bit of, we got a couple upgrade stuff. Nothing, nothing super crazy though. We'll go ahead and fill our rest of our inventory with squid. Because squid equals money. All right, fishmonger, everything. Oh, look at that. We still have a decent amount of money. I like that. All right, and then let's go into the dry dock here. And let's see. We need two wood for that. We need wood for that, two wood for that. And then we need a cloth for you. Okay, so actually I need wood now more than anything. Send those to our storage. Fantastic. And then, oh, I feel like we need to get, actually, hold on. Let's go back to the dry dock. Um, no, the ship, right? Let's look at our storage here. This gives us the ability to do oceanic. Is there an oceanic rod? There's not, there's this guy. Coastal shallow mangrove volcanic, which I, we haven't gone to a mangrove volcanic area yet. Uh, I'd have to, maybe we should replace the net. Let's uninstall this. And let's send it to storage and then let's go ahead and let's reinstall this guy. So that way we can do oceanic stuff again. Um, and then I actually want to uninstall you and move you over. All right. And it's six o'clock in the morning and we didn't get any sleep, did we? Uh, we'll be fine. Maybe. All right. So now we don't have a net. That's fine. Let's go out here. Let's do a little bit of, since we're kind of like out and about anyways, we need to, uh, we need to catch some things. So let's go to our pursuits. We need to get catch rare fish. Oarfish gulper eel, goliath tigerfish, and colcanth. Oarfish gulper eel. We need to get those. And then we need to get this rotting conger eel too. So let's go ahead and let's head back over to the Ingle Isles or whatever. And we'll ask where we can find those. And then maybe... Wait, what island is this? I don't think we've stopped by this island yet. Because there's a boat or something on here. Do we need to check this out? I feel like we need to check this out. What do we have here? You what? Approach a hooded figure swathed in dark blue robes. Their face is barely visible. Fisherman, please help. <laughs> you can barely hear the rasping voice above the wind of the waves. Fulfill the hunger. The hooded figure unfurls an old scroll. They point to the shape. Blue mackerel. They point to the shape of fish. It appears to be a blue mackerel. They want a blue mackerel. Okay. Well, that's interesting to say the least um i guess should we just go get a blue mackerel real quick i mean they're not hard to oh, hold on there's a boat here a rotten mass lays down on the island hidden by foliage at its base cracked in two look inside Ooh, we got some upgrades we got some goodies we got a thing of cloth here bag of doubloons this auto fetch decent price. It's literally a bag. Oh, it's a bag of blooms. Okay, so it's like old time money. Okay, let's go get a mackerel for this hooded figure. <laughs> um, actually, this might be mackerel right here. Yeah, this will work. Blue mackerel. Okay, that's it. I'm not trying to do a whole bunch of fishing right now. I just want to 
Well, that might have been blue mackerel right there too. <laughs> nope. It was like stingrays or flatfish or something. Put a figure. I have fulfilled the hunger. I've got it for you. There you go. With the expert precision, they plunge their hands through the gullet of the fish, tear out the heart. They stuff it in their mouth unceremoniously. More. Still empty. They point to another shape on the second scroll. Oh, tiger mackerel. This one looks like a tiger mackerel. Oh, well, okay. Near, now you're getting, now you're asking for a lot. Hold on. Actually. Blue mackerel. That's not tiger mackerel. Tiger mackerel. Okay. We're going to have to go. I know where tiger mackerel's at. It's not over here though. Oh, you know what I just realized? Did we get our final? We got our final research piece. That means we can th install a jet drive engine. <laughs> oh. Oh, you know what? Actually, right here, this might be the tiger mackerel that we need, and it's got the little glowy deal above it. So, it's a two for. Oh no, it's not. Oh well. Okay, so we did not get the mackerel. The mackerel's in a different spot. Let's go find that, but we'll sell the fish here and we'll get hopefully our new engine. We'll get it at the the jet drive engine as well. So let's see fish market. Sell all of those and then research engines of this guy. Last one. We've got it. And then let's see a uh, shipyard engine. We should be able to go ahead and install that right there. Oh, they don't have another one I know. So that gives us plus 9.5. Um, so that's like, you know, roughly 10. And these are 26.3 and 26.3. So if we add these two, that's another 20. So like, I mean, that's that's decent amount of uh, speed there. So let's go ahead and sleep. Maybe if we sleep, we'll come back. Maybe in the morning we'll have a um, another engine we can get. Yeah, look at that. Another engine. All right, put that bad boy on. No time to linger. All right, let's undock here. Oh, look at us go. Holy moly. All right, are you? That is not a tiger mackerel. Where are the tiger mackerel at? There we go. Oh man, we're cruising now. Look at us go. Oh, so fast. It's so good. It feels so good. All right, so this guy's still hungry. Here is your tiger mackerel. Rips in the flesh, strong as heart, consumes quickly as first. Almost fulfilled. And now they want a a snake mackerel. Okay. Snake mackerel. Let's see. Long, eely looking things. Actually, there might be. Was there some right here? No, no snake mackerel here. Almost positive there's some right over here, though. You know, I gotta say, those engine upgrades, like, make a huge difference. Okay. Now, are these snake mackerel or are these eel? Pretty sure those are eel. Gray eel. Yeah, that's not what I'm looking for. Okay, maybe over here in these rocks. I saw. Oh, dang it. How much damage? Oh, the one. Okay, that's fine. Where's the snake mackerel at? I thought we saw them somewhere. Oh, maybe these guys. No, these look like. Ooh. Yeah, look at that. We got a, uh, a great. Mmm. You know what? Let's just fish these guys up and call it good. What are these? Uh, see, those look like eel as well. Ooh, you know what? There's wood in here. Okay, we're going to draw out this uh, monster thing. Come on, buddy. Come on, monster fish. Where are you, monster... Oh, here he comes. Oh, nope. That was that thing. Maybe monster fish is still coming out. I don't want to go in there and start getting dredging that 
with the monster fish still in there. Hmm, okay. I'm trying to find these snake mackerel. I feel like we've seen them before. Oh, I don't know what this is. This is something different. Oh, sturgeons. Oh my gosh, Missy would love that. <laughs> she would not love that. <laughs> this is the first time we've ever caught sturgeons. <gasps> Are those them? Ah, uh, those look like eels as well. Let's catch one and see what it is. <gasps> oh, it's the Kongner eel. That's what we needed for um the lady. I don't know how many we needed, but that's where we're going to take those back right now. Oh, that's super exciting. Okay, so that's one of our things done. So hopefully she'll give us those. See, I thought we were going to have to go inside the um the inside those rocks. You know, a better light wouldn't be. <laughs> wouldn't be too bad either. All right, I don't want to sell everything here. I want to sell that, that one, and that one. I don't want to sell those yet. And then, actually, I want to look at the shipyard. Do you have any of the upgrades? Not right now. Okay. You know what? Let's go ahead and undock. Let's go get those uh, eels to that lady right now. So that way they're still fresh. Um, I've got your conger eels here. Oh, that's a conger eel, right? But it's not sufficiently aged. If I take it now, the dog is sure to snatch it before it fully ages. Please come back after it's had some time to mature. Anything else? Nothing else. Wait. It's got to be... It's too fresh? Oh, these are still fresh. Okay. Weird. All right, well, that's good to know that we got the conger eels. So we're trying to find those uh, mackerel, though. Uh, these are going to be more... Oop! Hold on. I thought... I... Okay, I thought there was big fish coming. The screen shook like there was big fish action coming in, but maybe not. Oh, no, there is definitely big fish action coming. There he is. Oh, there he is! Now, it looks like he stays uh, following me. Okay, we're in hot pursuit. Actually, he can't even catch us. We're too fast. We're way too fast now. Haha, <laughs> get wrecked, son. Um, okay, I'm looking for those eels or those uh, snake mackerels. Watch this. I learned this. I learned this trick. Swing around in here. He can't even get me. And then, boop. Nice and safe. Ha ha ha. We're gonna let him go by. <laughs> We're gonna let him just cruise on by. Because there's wood right there. I need the wood for the upgrades. Alright, he should be far enough away now. We should be okay. Um, okay, things just moved again. We're going to wait and see if he pops out. All right, let's go grab that wood. Maybe it was that thing. All right, it's been depleted. We're going to go ahead and just hang out here. Uh, we'll just sleep here for the night, and then we'll head back. And still looking for those mackerel, too. Oh, we got, a re we got an upgrade part here. Hold on. We have to get this. Yes, please. And then let's see, this is going to want, what kind of fish do you want? What is that? Like a crab? Oh, it does. It wants those fiddler crabs. It's might be fiddler crabs. We might need to get a whole bunch of those. Okay. Bring those over here. That might give us some kind of upgrade too, or I've upgraded beyond the point of that <laughs> because I've really been focusing on the upgrades. 
So there's a chance that I've upgraded past where I should be right now. Oh no, those eels are rotted. Oh, they're gonna be, they're gonna be, they're gonna be rotten now. Oh my gosh. Hold on, let's go see what happens now. I had your eels, but I don't have them now. Ah, oh, nothing. Darn it. Okay, we waited. I waited too long. Well, you know what? We know where we we could get them. We just have to wait till it gets dark out. Oh, can't believe that. All right, let's see. Uh, floating dock. What do we have? We needed three boards for that, two boards for that, and two for that. So let's get the. Uh, we've got three. Why don't we get the three one done? There we go. So we got two more rod slots, and then um, shipyard. Let's check. Do you have any? Yes, 315. I will take that. And let's go ahead and do some research here. So we've got the jet drives already. Pots and nets, we're not worried about that. So we could start working on this harvesting platform. Or we could start working towards the new engines. You know what? Let's work towards this harvesting platform. Because then if we get this one installed, we'll have everything we need all the time. And then if we need mangrove or volcanic or whatever we can um we can always get that but this would give us the ability to fish anywhere except for you know uh, abyssal and haddle i think or do we want to go for engines because the faster we get places the faster the more we can get done <laughs> mm. you know what let's do the rod okay All right, we're gonna do a little bit of resting here and we're gonna get up and we're gonna undock because it's supposed to be dark now we're gonna go get those eel all right we got the eel so this time we got to pay attention though is that wood mm, might be cloth okay we need to head out of here though <laughs> the darkness is creeping in oh yeah there it goes okay Stop panicking. We're fine. Everything's fine. Okay, so our eel are still fresh. We need to keep an eye on them. We need to make sure that they're not fresh. Oh, we got a trophy one coming up. Oop. Nailed it. Okay, see, now they're stale. So let's take them over here and let's see what we got. I've got your conger here. Yeah. It's not sufficiently aged. Are you kidding me? Stale, stale, stale. How long before I see? I get there's a fine line. I'm sure there's probably like. Um. Stale. Okay, let's go fish a little bit more. Actually, I don't know if we have room for what are these guys. I don't really have a lot of room for these guys. All right, I'm going to sleep and I'm going to hope that they go between they're stale. Well, you know what? Let's just see what they are now. Rotting. Okay. All right. All right. There we go. Rotting. Maybe that's what she wants. Here's your conger eel you asked for. Oh, there it is. This will do wonderfully. I can offer you a small sum and thanks. 150. Oh, nice. Okay. So now that we've got her thing done, she's going to give us money, darn it. I was hoping she was something else. Um, we'll rest for the rest of the night. All right. And then these are rotting. Disgusting. Now let's go over here and let's see what we need for the... Um, we need to get this fish for this lady because this lady wanted some fish too. She wanted rare fish though, and we got to ask her about them because I don't know where they're all at. Are you going to give us any money for these? Oh, yeah. Ah. All right. So tell us hmm. about the ore fish. Long, fragile body. I suspect they live in a reasonably deep but calm water. Maybe the shelter gale cliffs would suit them. What about the other fish? Live in the deepest depths imaginable. You have to get some specialist gear to catch one of those. Oh. 
Uh, what about the other fish? Tiger fish. Legitimately scary. They hunt in murky, swampy waters and using the shade of trees as cover. Okay, so that's going to be the mangrove area. Actually, I have no idea where the Colcanthus might be, but they have a primordial feel to them, don't you think? Interesting. So the ore fish, reasonably deep but calm water, the gale cliffs would suit them. Okay. So it looks like we might be able to bring one fish to her for now. Um. So maybe... Maybe somewhere over here. We still need to get in this 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 area right here. I don't know what that, that area is exactly. Actually, can we cut through? If I go through right here, right here. I mean, there's gonna be a giant fish in there, but we might be able to outrun him. Mm. Yeah, there he is. I'm super curious about this fish. If we can ever hunt it, you know? Let's see if he's behind us. Means we should be able to cut through all of here. <laughs> Okay, deep, calm water. Did we lose him? That's not an oarfish. Oh, we didn't. He's right there. Coming in. This could be an oarfish. Oh, I hear angry, I hear angry fish again. Hmm, I bet you he's inside there. I need those explosives. I have a feeling maybe we could take that big fish out with explosives. I'm telling you, I feel like he's in here. Should we make a like a quick quick look? Oh he's right there! Oh he's eating me! Oh, there's the holes right there. Oh, he's got holes. Oh, okay. Hmm. <laughs> I feel like we need something to deal with that thing. Like, I feel like the explosives is what exactly what we need for that. I don't know. We're going to keep moving, though. Does this look like an ore fish? That's not an ore fish. Oh, we need the crabs for that. We still need the, um, we need that snake mackerel for the other questionable dude we need so many things there was definitely a sound of something out there don't know what it was don't know what it was did we get any fish we didn't even get any fish uh let's get some repairs though oh, we were attacked all right so we've got those um let's see here can we grab where's the floating dock let's get I needed, did I get cloth? I got cloth and I didn't even need it, did I? Nope. All right, we're gonna go try something stupid here. <laughs> we're gonna see if it works. There is a mark on my map and there's something back in that cove that we need to get. I'm gonna go in there. We're gonna try to get that guy, that fish to come out uh, and swim, hit, like attack us once, swim away. And we're just gonna try to dredge it and get out of there. Because I think we can take, uh, this, this is a tier three hole. And I think it said we could take maybe two hits, maybe three. And I know we need to get in here for that glowing thing right there. I know that's a goal. Okay, there's one hit. Oh, and now I'm now I'm too slow. That thing is really interesting looking. See, I wonder if I could drop uh, explosives on it, like bloop, 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 you know, and then kill it. How do I get you to go away? <gasps> oh, oh, he might be done.
Let's just get this thing and get out of here. That's the family crest. All right, let's roll. So you can, he, he gets tired of chasing you after a while. That's good to know. I'm still curious if I could drop explosives on his face. All right, let's get repaired up here. <laughs> okay, good. And then I didn't get anything, so we'll sleep. We'll go return this thing to the guy. So this guy over here was the one that had the crest from his brother. His brother is the one that made six, six, makes the explosives. So I'm hoping by finishing this one that we can get the other guy to start making explosives. You know, they'll be happy again. Or his brother will help him make the explosives. Okay, so Hermit. Hello again. What can I do for you? Is this your family crest? You found it. I never thought I'd see this beauty again. But now I have a further favor to ask. Would you take this to my brother? Yeah. Tell him that his brother's sorry and would like to come home. Easy enough. Oh, I. you know what I just realized? I know what's going to happen. That chain right there into the water. We're going to we're going to lure that fish out and it's going to get caught on there somehow. And then they're going to pull it up and then they're going to uh, refine it. And yep, they're going to use that giant fish as like a whale, essentially. Uh-huh. That's what's going to happen. I'm calling it right now. I believe this crest is yours. I haven't seen this since since. Hmm. So he did take it and knew it. Your brother's sorry. Will you let him come home? I don't know if I was in the right state when he left. He can come stay in my old workshop, at least for the time being, but I'll need to clear it out. While I'm doing that, perhaps you can do something for me. So I've been trying to clear some debris in the pathways through the cliff to make a shortcut with explosives. I was able to set the charge, but the cliff seemed particularly unsteady that day, so I didn't risk detonating it. You just need to get in there and set it off. It's not far in. I just left some yellow flags nearby. You can't miss it. Anything else? Um, nope, we are good. Oh my gosh, let's go set off some explosives. Do we need to sleep? No, undock, we're good. Okay, um, so we are going into here. Wait, hold on. We're going in right here and right there. See, this is that area that we were going in circles with. Okay, so I guess I don't want to shawl net, I want this. Okay. All right, let's do it. Where's the big fish face coming from? Oh, right there. Oh, no, I can't turn around in time. Oh, man. Hot pursuit, hot pursuit. We'll do this. We're going to go in a circle. Ha ha. Why she like stop following me and turn around? Uh huh. Yes. You light the fuse. Kaboom. The debris. You should let the whaler know. All right, I did. We did the thing. We blew the hole in the place. We need to get that fish out of there though. Oh no, he's coming right for us. Oh, I'm too fast. Ha ha. Squeak past him. Can't touch us. <laughs> uh, okay. All right. Let's dock real quick and uh, get to the safety of a, a shore. Maybe not. Maybe you've done it. We heard the blast from here. God's the echo. I'm surprised the cliffs didn't come down on your head. Uh, I've got things ready to go. Go tell my brother. He can come home. Yes. I'm telling you right now, we're going to end up doing something with that thing and it's going to get put in that building and they're going to uh, process it down and use it for like, they're going to, they're going to do something with it. They're going to sell it to the, all the people or something and everybody's going to go crazy from eating it. All right, Hermit, you can come home. Your brother forgives you. He found a place for you to stay. Does that's a huge weight off my chest. One soul is hardly there. Uh, okay, let's go. Grab you, throw you there. All right. All right. Well, here we are. We noticed the old whaler standing on the dock waiting for him. A little brother, you're home. So sorry. I was so foolish. We both were. Come on inside. Let's get your bags. Two of us walk down the dock. One of them pauses for a moment and turns back to you. Oh, stranger. If you find any more debris that needs clearing, I'm working on making some more packed explosives. Come by the old whaling yards anytime. Right there. 
Yeah, wailing yards. Hey, this is on the house for all your help. Oh, <gasps> packed explosives. Yes. I hope you can put them in good use wherever you find a cause for it. Okay, so these are 36 piece hollowed out whale teeth packed with powdery substance. <laughs> a fuse coils up from the top. Now, can I use this to blow up the stupid fish? That's like what I want to try the most. Um, all right, if we undock is explosive is not on here. Hmm. Pick up. So I must have to, I must have to place it somewhere. Okay, hold on. So let's do this then. Let's get some things done here. Cause I know for a fact we need it for this debris right here. Apollo's debris can be cleared up with, uh, use explosives. Perfect. Debris crumbles away. And then we can grab all this stuff out of here. Uh, relic discovered. Okay, so that is the chest for the the music box for the key, and then we can back up a little bit and we can grab this. And then what do we have in there? Just sapphire earrings. Okay, neat. Let's go ahead and dock here and just sleep here for the night. There's nothing else here. Uh, let's see. So we need to head over there. I'm trying to think. We need, um... Gosh, I really wish I could use the explosives on that big fish. I think that'd be so much fun. Um, okay, let's go turn this music box into this guy. See what he gives us. And we still never found the snake mackerel. I'm aware of that. So we'll have to try to find that at some point. Yeah, see, there's something down there we gotta... Oh. That's the abyssal stuff. Oh, I can't wait to get into that. No, you guys aren't snake mackerel, are you? No. Snake mackerel? No, oh, these look like eels as well. Yeah, just a gray eel. All right, let's turn this key into this guy. Or not this key, this box. Oh, come on. I wish there was like a steering upgrade that made it a little bit more, uh, uh, a little bit more useful. Um, okay, hold on. Oh, <gasps> the workshop. That's what the, uh, the DLC was. Okay, so you return. I wasn't sure you were coming back. Drag the massive music box in the room, gouging the wooden floorboards beneath it. The collector doesn't seem to mind. He's focused on the box. You found this at the cliffs, didn't you? Yes. Ah, excellent. This should make future return journeys a little more swift. Allow me. He selects one of the silver ribbons trailing from the Crimson Bound book, opening it to some unseen page. Turning to catch the dim line, he whispers words on the page. After a few seconds, you feel your stomach drop suddenly as though you were hit by a huge wave. He closes the book, turns his attention back to you. Ability unlocked manifest. Instantly return back to Blackstone Isle. Now there are yet more relics to find. Keep looking. The reef at Stellar Basin may have caught and accumulated some wreckage. Search around that area. I'll mark the location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? Um, the words you read from the book, what did they do to me? The book holds power from deep. Um, I merely extended its powers towards you. Uh, is there one particular wish you need to know about? Haste? Manifest? No, I'm good. Anything else? Nope. And let's see this workshop. Is there any the workshop that looks like it has been used in decades? Go inside. Oh, <gasps> you enter taking a moment for your eyes to adjust the dim light. What do you want to do in here? Pick up items. Find some horrifying creations amongst the debris. What? The bloody blades of this grotesque engine are driven by a pulsing heart. It beats in time with your own. Arterial engine. Sign of ruin. A symbol of the deep is carved into the small talisman. It's sure to draw the attention of those attuned to it. What? Okay. 
And then this is an arterial engine. Um, it's weird though, because it doesn't. It's so it's like speed is seven point four. This is nine point five. This is better, but then this is like weird. You know what I mean? Like I kind of want to figure it out. <laughs> like, um, let's do this. Let's uninstall this one. Send that to storage, and let's grab this guy. Let's put it here. Let's just see what happens. Um, uh, pick up items. You've already taken the items that were stored here. Okay, leave. Now, I don't know if that changes like uh, later, but interesting, to say the least. Arterial engine, and then this sign of ruin. A symbol of the deep is carved into the small talisman. It's sure to draw the attention of those attuned to it. No idea. Uh, very cool. Now, it, they were supposed to go where now? Oh, Stellar Basin. Way out in here. That looks like a volcanic area right there. And this probably is the mangrove. Very interesting. Oh my gosh, that's super exciting. Um, hold on. Let's go ahead. Let's take a peek here. Oh my gosh. We gotta get that fixed. So, if I go to here, haste, manifest, teleport yourself back to where it all began. That is actually really cool. Uh, because that is actually like, that's dead center of the map. So... That'd be, that's going to be really nice. Now, is it going to make us go crazy? Possibly. <laughs> uh, maybe. Just maybe. But I think we'll be okay with that. Oh, the lightest keeper is waiting for you on the dock. Looking displeased. I saw you sailing out towards the horizon. Crossing that deep expanse. Do you really think that's wise? It was fine. Maybe this time. You need to be more careful. Even you, with all your experience, cannot truly know the ocean. Nobody can. Abruptly, she walks away. Her eyes scan the water she walks along the dock okay i need to go ahead and repair everything and then i guess that's it isn't it we don't have i need wood i need th i need what four pieces of wood in order to get these two and then we have a new hole to work on um and that's actually the max hole too that's gonna be that's gonna be super cool but that is going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, like, subscribe, all the fun things. Next episode. Oh my gosh. Next episode. I don't even know. Um, I think what I'll probably do till then is I probably will go ahead and get the um, the net spaces. This. And then I'll probably get all the materials. At least for this guy. And maybe the money ready. So that way next episode we'll hop in. Maybe get a tier 4 hole. Work on upgrades for that. And then uh, in the meantime, I'll probably go ahead and start working on upgrades towards some of these things. And uh, grind and out some stuff. So yeah. But thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time. Bye everybody.